Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and today we're going to talk about a tool that I use to create bootable USB thumb drives for Windows. So when you need a USB thumb drive that has a bootable um, you know, install of Windows 10, the tool that comes with Windows uh, when you actually download the media creation tool does create a bootable uh, USB drive but it doesn't work on all PCs sometimes you need to have a different type of bootable USB drive and that's where Rufus is uh, actually a good tool what's also nice about Rufus it's not just for Windows if you have uh, Linux uh, ISOs Linux images that you want to have a, a create a bootable thumb drive with Rufus will also do that so anything you have that you want to create a bootable drive it's going to work with Rufus. So um, I'll share the link to the page where you can download this tool. Once you download it, it's going to show up like this. So this is the tool. It's going to show you your USB thumb drive. So before you launch the tool, you need to actually have your thumb drive installed. It has to be a thumb drive. You can't use an external hard drive. It only works with um, really USB thumb drives. So here you see my no label 8 gigabyte drive you now select the disk or image that you want but you can also try and do a free DOS if you want so it means you would have a DOS bootable drive if you need that for some reason then you select of course the image where you want to check that out so here Windows 10 May 2019 update it is in my example here what I want to use once that is done you will see standard Windows installation now there are two uh, part partition schemes and two types of systems that you can boot from. In modern PCs you will want to have GBT, GPT partition and UEFI as target system because these modern type of firmware BIOS is what actually will be bootable. But if you have an older machine you'll have to change this and you'll have to choose MBR and BIOS instead. So if you have an older machine, this is the way that you might need to actually have the drive, um, format the drive and install the image so that you can boot from it. Then you will have volume label, you give it a name that you want and uh, typically most of the time you don't really touch the other information, you leave it like that. And of course there's advanced format options, quick format, you can create extended label and icon files and check device for bad blocks. There are things you can do to, you know, if you think your uh, USB thumb drive might be flaky, well, you can actually use that to actually test it out and make sure it's okay. So that's all that you need, and that's how it works. Uh, and this will create a bootable Windows 10 install USB drive uh, that you can use. Now, it will erase everything on your drive. Very important to understand that it destroys all the data on your drive. So if you have a drive with some stuff on it, don't use it because if you use this, you're going to lose what's on your drive. It will be replaced with the uh, install files. So you click start and you let it do its job and when it's over then you'll be able to close and then uh, you'll be able to boot from that USB drive. The link to the tool, Rufus tool, is in the description below the video. All you have to do is go to this page and there is a download, Rufus 3.5 here, as of uh, July 5th, uh, 1st, sorry, 2019. Enjoy our videos. Please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.